I'm just waking up. Someone else knows. No, he's been awake. He's my alarm clock. I'm trying to just do it. I'm endlessly scrolling on TikTok these days. I'm not motivated. And I have so many ideas in my head and I just I just want to do it and I know most days if I can just like sit down and actually like slowly start doing what I want to do which is either print out my stickers and like make more sheets then then I can do it but I it's hard it's just hard sometimes I try to motivate myself with you know talking to friends about it um but it's just hard I want to be a content creator you know I want to upload on YouTube. Um, right now I'm looking at Tiffany Wang and um, I really like her. She's cute. But like I see content creators and like I just have to record and I have to get into the habit of doing it. Like that's what I have to remind myself. I have to get into the habit. I haven't even brushed my teeth. And I always brush my teeth. Also I don't. <laughs> I remember this about making videos <laughs> where I'm like I'm looking at myself because I'm using my phone. I only use my phone to record. But then the camera's over here. And like, I want to watch you, but I want to watch me. So I don't know. I just, I just want to do stuff. I want to make my art. That's my passion. I want to make art and I want to, I love making art. I went to, <laughs> went to Halloween, uh, a Halloween party yesterday, and it was really fun. Yesterday? The day before. <laughs> um, and it was really fun. I met up with my friend, um, and she, wait, where'd you go? She said I was talking too much. I said I was talking too much. So, I went to a Halloween party yesterday, and... Wow, I went to a Halloween party the day before. <laughs> it was really fun. I dressed up as my usual dinosaur costume. It's just a onesie. It's super comfortable. I love it. Then I, my friend uh, ordered a costume and she went as an avocado. And we looked super cute because we were both green. And then we had like jean jackets because it's cold in New York. We got to the party and it looked like we were matching and I loved it. I just got to like hang out with close friends. I got to see friends that I haven't seen in a while. And oh my God, the house that they decorated it. So fucking beautifully. So freaking beautifully. It was so inspiring uh, just, just seeing them. But yeah, like that was really fun. But then by like 10 o'clock, I was super sleepy. You know, I usually go to bed early because of my job. I, I work at six in the morning. So I have to be out of the house early and I have to get up early, but I'm my, my internal clock. I'm just always sleepy um, around 10 p.m. <laughs> it's just I'm sleepy. I can't stay up, but I can't stay up anymore. I'm not like before and I like it because then look, at it's seven. It's 749 right now, but I did wake up at like 630 and I get to enjoy the sunrise. I'm gonna go to the post office soon because I wanna mail out something, an actual art print that I had an unfortunate accident with. I had mailed it out and I like wrote the address incorrectly, but like, it was just like one part. The, the zip code was fine and everything, but for some reason it still didn't arrive there. So I'm gonna try again today. Hopefully it, it goes on. Then I'm gonna try and edit this video. So <laughs> I was gonna say it's Monday, October 31st. You know, a lot of vlogs do that. A lot of vlogs on YouTube do that. They like tell you the date. And I don't know why that has always turned me off, but I'm gonna try. So it's October 31st. I know I already said it, I'm gonna try. And, and like, let's just see what happens. If, if I like it in the video, I don't have to use it. I don't want to, you know, I have a small infection in one of my ears. 
in one of my earrings. So I put a little piece of tissue paper. I just want you to be completely, just want you to know completely everything that's happening. Now I'm like, what do I talk about? Uh, I'm gonna edit out all the ums. That'll be cute. A shout out to InShot. That's what I use, that's my editing app. I love it, I think it's super simple. It's gotten me through things. I think it's simple enough that I actually edit videos. There was another thing, there was another application that I am curious about. It's like Capture, something Capture, because they came out with a PC version and I'm, I'm curious about it because I would love to edit videos on my PC. But then I thought about the reason why I edit on my on my phone is because the videos are big and my my laptop is usually used it has a lot of art documents and those are as we all know they're really big in size and they take up a lot of space I'm not trying to get a new laptop until I can until I have the money so I'm gonna see if Maybe I shouldn't, I shouldn't do it. Like when I get a new laptop, maybe I'll look into that other app. I have it downloaded on my phone and then I instantly felt like betrayal. I was like, no, I'm betraying. I'm betraying InShot. I shouldn't do that. Can you tell I have some, <laughs> some, what, what is it even called? Like, oh gosh, I was gonna say some problems, but a little bit like attachment issues or like, I don't wanna, Oh man, what is that called? Wait, I'm gonna I'm gonna Google it. Like like let letting someone down letting someone down um wording? No. Letting someone down scared. Fear of letting someone down anxiety about letting people down yeah like i do definitely have anxiety over that but like what's the word for that word word for <laughs> for that i sort of got my google search <laughs> abandonment fear of abandonment i don't know i know let down i'm just scared of like letting them down i love the app i think it's been there for me it's the one app that actually started i'm talking about an app i know but it's the one app that like really got me editing you know because it was so simple and i think like deep down i have this attachment to it um even though i've never even spoken with them at all like the company or anything I would love to get sponsored by them. Look at me talking about sponsorship when I haven't even uploaded a video in like years. But <laughs> it's never too late. It's I should I should always reach for the stars, which is why I'm making this video in the first place. Yeah. So what was I saying? Something about my laptop where yeah, I don't want to edit on my laptop yet until I get a new one. I'm gonna edit on my phone because I have a bunch of Google accounts and I just save everything on my Google Cloud. Google Drive? Yeah. Yeah. That's fine. Then, so yeah. So that's what I'm gonna do today. I'm gonna motivate myself to do some work. I made a sticker last night. I was very proud of that. Ho, ho, ho. Very proud of that. What else? Mm. I have a couple other stickers that I want to finish that I can put up. They're not at all winter related. They're just stickers. Oh, I made this, but it came out like crap. Well, it didn't come out like crap, but it just, it's hard to print double-sided. So, wow, it's backwards. <laughs> it's a stay cozy winter is winter is coming don't let seasonal depression sink you in remind yourself that you are strong patience is key you are only human be kind to yourself i've always wanted to make some art prints that you can like that i can put in like 
my sticker envelopes and then you can like put this up as like you know something that you put on your wall i have this one i bought this one from um ducky and this one's mine but i have one i have an old one of catnip when i bought washi tape from her and it was just so cute like i have it up you know and and i think i have it up up here um on my table but like it just made me happy and i was like i want to make little art prints that i can just oh and i can put um my info in the back which is my qr code that's all of my info i think this is a little neater than um writing it out and then i says hola thank you so much for supporting my small business i would really love it if you could tag me on any posts you make on social on social media and then that's my handle at Kati Camilo. I created a little bit, but so what I've learned is I have to make this a little smaller so that there's more of a white border. Actually, just I think I just can put a white border and then see what size it comes out so that it gives me more room to cut it so that it's more even. And I think I have to make a line to be quite honest so that I can cut it, cut it. But yeah, they came out, they did come out cute, but I just have to do that. And then also, they're not gonna be perfect. I don't intend them to be perfect. That's one thing I wrote in my book the other day. I, some, I write down things so that I don't overwhelm myself. I wrote in my book, I said, these didn't come out perfect at all. Like some of these, like I cut the QR code. They're not perfect. I have a printer and I have a Cameo 4 right now because I can make stuff at home so I can trial and error my products and see what sells and what doesn't sell. And from there, when I see that something is selling out constantly, then I can go and like go to Sticker App or Sticker Ninja, Ninja Sticker and use them to outsource because then I will be making the money to do it because uh, essentially it's going to roughly cost the same. Me buying the sticker paper and the ink and the time can cost the same as me ordering the stickers and then selling them again. But I am really picky also on like how I do my stickers so but yeah. So these are the, those are the plans. I've I've talked for 14 minutes. I'm proud of myself. <laughs> this wasn't as bad as I thought. There were a couple of times that I got a little emotional. You didn't, I don't know, I, I don't think you could see it in the video, but I was like getting emotional because I was talking <laughs> and that's just the person that I am. And yeah, okay, I'm gonna stop now because yeah, there's a lot, there's a lot. But I'm gonna, I'll try to make more. I'll try to make more videos. And yeah. Okay, goodbye. <laughs>